anomers anomers the pair of dash stereomers or the pair of stereo isomers differ in the configuration at c1 carbon the pair of isomers are a pair of dash stereomers differ in the configuration at c1 carbon atom known as anomers for example oh hydrogen CH2 OH OH hydrogen hydrogen OH OH hydrogen hydrogen this is the first carbon this is which carbon sixth carbon 3 4 5 now this is the first carbon which is which side right side so that is the reason why it is known as alpha d plus glucopyranose alpha d plus glucopyranose second one is First carbon OH is right side is known as alpha form. If the first carbon OH is left side is known as beta form. OH hydrogen, hydrogen OH third carbon, fourth carbon OH is right. Fifth carbon oxygen involved in cyclic linkage. Fourth carbon four, two, three, four, five. This is a fifth carbon. Then here is what? Sixth carbon. Okay. So if the first carbon OH is left side, this form is known as beta D plus beta D plus glucopyranose, beta D plus glucopyranose. So these two are a pair of diastereomers. First, these two are what diastereomers. means non superimposable non mirror images to each and other so that is the reason why a pair of diastereomers differ in the configuration at c1 carbon known as what in a, known as what anomers so that is the reason why alpha d plus glucopyranose beta d plus glucopyranose are what diastereomers are known as what diastereomers because at C1 chiral center at C1 chiral center here OH is right side here OH is what left so this is alpha form this is which form beta form so that is the reason why these two are diastereomers differ in the configuration at C1 carbon epimers means the pair of diastereomers which are differ in the configuration except to C1 carbon except to C1 carbon known as epimers general examples that are what glucose and mannose are C2 epimers D glucose and D galactose are C4 epimers anomers are the pair of diastereomers differ in the configuration at C1 carbon only known as anomers